www.everydaychallengeworkouts.com. I have a complex uh, challenge workout for you today. I'm going to show you how to do it with a barbell and then how you can also do it with um, a set of dumbbells. I'm working on an overhead squat. I really like doing overhead squats. I put it first in the complex because form is so important. Um, I don't have much on the bar because I'm going to be doing high pulls. I'm going to be doing the overhead squat uh, and then some spider push-ups. Uh, remember for complexes, we're not working on speed, we're working on adding load, but only when our form is perfect. Uh, this is a wrist and few workouts. So you're going to do five reps of the first exercise and you're going to finish up with. All right, so we're going to start with an overhead squat. If you're not comfortable with an overhead squat, you can do a front squat. All right, so um, I'm just going to show you uh, the exercise. I'm not going to go through a full round. I don't have the clock going. I just want to show you the, the form. So I'm going to show you sideways on that overhead squat so that you can see how my hands are right above my shoulders. My shoulders are right loaded on top of my, my hips and I drop my hips down. All right, I'm pressing my armpits forward. I want to show you um, front ways so that you can see, although I'm hitting my pull-up bar or my bar over there. All right, so keep looking up for that overhead squat. All right, so if you don't, if you're not comfortable with the overhead squat, then you're just gonna do the front squat for five reps. All right, then you're gonna finish up with, I wanna go sideways on this one, you're going to finish up with a weighted burpee. You can add the push-up if you'd like. What I want you to make sure is that you've got that nice flat back here, not a rounded back. Flat back for the weighted burpee. You're probably going to have about 30 seconds on that weighted burpee. All right? Now, step two is you're going to do five bent over rows. So again, nice flat back. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Now this one, I want you to go slow on the way down because you're going to be a little bit stronger on the bent over row, so work that eccentric contraction, all right? So after the bent over row, you're going to finish up with a high pull. Now this one's going to get challenging for you because you're probably going to have about 40 seconds on the high pull, elbows up to the ceiling, all the way up to your toes. Remember, you're doing just a quarter squat and um, uh, nice tight abs. Bring the bar up to your chin. Okay, now we're going to put the bar down and we're going to do five per leg spider crawl push ups. So you're going to do 10 of those all together. The key with that is that nice flat back. It's more of a challenge when you're doing it on the bar because you have to control that roll. And you're going to finish up with some ab rollouts. Now, when I did this, um, when I did good quality Spider-Man push-ups, uh, I got about seven or eight on the ab rollout. Okay, so if you don't have a bar, you can do the same thing, but you're going to do it with dumbbells. Do not do an overhead um, squat with dumbbells. Just do the front squat. All right, you can easily do the weighted burpee with the, bar, uh, with the dumbbells, okay? Uh, you can do the bent over row uh, with the dumbbells, and of course, then you would do the high pull as well, and spider push-ups as well. So everything else is the same. Spider push-up, obviously you're not gonna be able to do the ab rollout, so you're either going to do a plank reach or, so the plank reach looks like this, okay, where the hips aren't rocking, or a plank with an alternate leg lift. When you do that alternate leg lift, make sure that you don't lift the leg too high, don't rock, rock the hips. So those are six exercises, five on the squat, roll, and push up and then finish up with the burpee high pull and then the ab move, whether it's the roll out, the plank reach, or the um, alternate leg lift on the plank. Now, those are the three kind of supersets and I did that five times. So that's an awesome um, complex challenge workout. You don't need much space. You need either a bar or 
uh, dumbbells. And again, form, form, form. Don't worry about speed, worry about quality of movement. Uh, let me know how that one goes.